Because it's hysterical. Because it's romantic. Because the characters are a family. Because the cast is amazing. And they interact with fans a lot. Because so much character development! Excalibur is personified. He's adorable! Because Santa Claus is real! Because Mrs. Claus is real! And her name is Gretchen. Because Bob Newhart. Because John Larroquette. Because theater references. Because Doctor Who references. Because literature references. Because all kinds of nerdy references. Because fictional characters come to life. Because Evelyn. Because Jasandra. Because dragons! Because Ezekiel Jones. Because Cassandra's outfits. Because they have goats! Because there's a sun in the sunroom. Because they have a room full of bees. Because time travel. Because Ariel is in it! He's got a Scottish accent. Because Flynn's acting. Because Eve's nope fits. Because they go into a video game. Because there's an episode with fairy tales. The Emperor's new clothes is one of them. Because Camelot plot lines. Because Shakespeare plot lines. Because Stumpy! Because Christmas Eve will never be the same again. Because there's no significant love triangle to worry about. Because they travel the world. Because husband and wife played mortal enemies. He had to stab her. Because the Christmas episode, the episode that was literally an AU fic, because Cassandra Killeen is the most adorable, precious character to ever walk the face of fictional anything, and if any of you lay a finger on her, including you writers, and hurt her, I- <laughs> So Jacob Stone, because I'm pretty sure Jenkins is on the naughty list. So is Mrs. Claus, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Dinosaurs! Because drunk Cassandra, because someone so evil, Lamia, should not be so lovable. But she is. Because it'll rip your heart out. When you least expect it. Never how you expect it. Because you might go to medical school just so you can become a doctor who tries to find the cure for brain tumors. Because no main characters have died. Yet. Oh my god, I gotta knock on wood. Can't cry over a dead sword. Or a dying building. Or a dead statue. Yeah, we do a lot of crying here. We hug it out for humanity. Frankenstein's creature is on Tinder. He finally gets the happiness he deserved. Fuck you, Victor Frankenstein. Because the show finally referenced the curse of the Scottish play. Because there's a science fair. Because they meet the Pope. Because Jenkins gets to be a sugar daddy. Because the library has a theater. Because Ezekiel is obsessed with the poltergeist. Because Einstein discovered Atlantis. Because Schrodinger's cat is alive! Because the clippings book. Because Ray. Because Charlene's sass. Because Jake's fanboying. Because Flynn's fanboying. Because Cassandra's fangirling. Because the baking soda volcano. Because Robot Huntsman. The Ninja Princess. Because Merlin disguised as Prince Charming. Because Demented Hogwarts. Because they broke into the Vatican. Because they broke into Buckingham Palace. Because they go into the labyrinth. Because Morgan Le Fay. Because the Tree of Knowledge. Because Bro TPs. Because Mathematics. Because Science Done with Music Notes. Because Baby Brother Ezekiel. Because we are the Lits. And it's a life, mystery, misery, of loneliness, adventure. As we save the world every week before Friday. Finally, because magic. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. So, it hasn't even been a month since season 2 ended, and already I am I'm losing it. I'm already losing it. I'm already theorizing about season 3. I'm already like, where are the sneak peeks? Where are the set pictures? Give me news about season 3. And it hasn't even been a month. Yeah, this hiatus is going to be even less fun than the first hiatus, because the first hiatus, I didn't really get into the fandom until a month after the season ended, and then after that, you know, the obsession kind of built in. It wasn't a full obsession until, like, four months before the show premiered, but now I've got the full ten months being at this level of obsession. It's gonna be good fun, guys.
So that's it for today. Um, I put up librarians vlogs every Sunday. If there is another video like this one relating to 101 reasons or any other kind of librarians related video that you'd like to see me do, please leave the suggestion in a comment below or you can drop it off at my Tumblr inbox or messaging inbox at kingdomkeepersofthelibrary at tumblr.com. And that's it. So I hope you're having a wonderful day, Litz. And I'll see you next week. Bye!